Ow. Hi and welcome to Vincenzo's Plate Vlog and welcome to Lucrezia. Hi everyone. Who is Lucrezia? Well, Lucrezia, first of all, is from Rome. Yeah, and this is uh, San Pietro, San Peter. San Peter's Church, everybody, right there. You cannot visit San Peter if you come to Rome. But Lucrezia has an amazing channel where she teaches you Italian the right way. Learn Italian with Lucrezia. Lucrezia is also my teacher because I forget uh, Italian and He's my great no, teacher. You Look don't. at it. You speak so well. No. Yeah, you do. You speak English better than me and Italian better than me. So. No, 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 no. That's so, not true. So today, Lucrezia is going to take us to the parts, secret spots of Rome that you don't know. Right, Lucrezia? Right, that's right. So let's start from this place. This is St. Peter. Tell us yeah. about this. What's this place? Okay, so if you come to St. Peter's Square, you have to try and stand on that spot because if you stand there, you can see that the columns that usually like curves, they curve. But if you stand there, um, the columns in the front hide the columns in the back. So they just make a clear line of columns. And they basically, like the other columns disappear. So it's quite fun to see and check out because not everyone knows this trick. So I hope you, you check it out if you come to Rome. Now we are ready to go and see the secret spots of Rome with Lucrezia. That's how I feel like going today, it's so hot. Yeah. <laughs> so I've, I've been coming to Rome for about 30 years now. I've never been to a place like this. This is, we are right in the center of Rome and what's yeah. this hidden secret spot? Lucrezia, tell me. This is called Via dei Coronari and it's a very famous uh, but hidden street in, in the city center. And it is very famous because in the 60s it was like uh, the place to buy antiques. In fact, it was full of uh, antique shops and there are still some remaining today, as for example this one, which sells beautiful antiques. And it's really cool because it's not a very touristy place you can see Romans like having a stroll around or eat an ice cream because like Romans live actually here. So it's a cool place to like calm down from the fuss of the city center. Bye. Thank you so much Lucrezia for showing me and our friends this beautiful uh, secret spot of Rome. It was a pleasure, thank you for following me. Ah, it's a pleasure for me. I'm actually hungry now. So Lucrezia is going to take us to this beautiful Roman restaurant where you have the authentic Roman dishes. Yeah. Something like... Like a matriciana, bucatini alla matriciana, but like the real ones. The real deal. Yeah, oh, the real deal. You don't go to this place to have carbonara with cream. You have the real carbonara as well, right? Yeah. So we're going to go. What's it called? Uh, Trattoria Lilli. Oh, sounds good. Yeah. Lilli's the chef. No, I don't know who that Someone. is. Someone. Yeah. The nonna. So, in the family for sure. <laughs> so stay tuned because in the next video you will see the best place to eat in Rome according to a friend from Rome, Lucrezia. So thank you very much for watching this video. We will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate vlog and um, make sure you check out Lucrezia's channel if you want to learn how to speak Italian very well and learn yeah. more about the culture. So Lucrezia, what's it called? Learn Italian with Lucrezia, simple as that. Very Just simple. type it on Google. Also check out the link here. Can you see the link? Can you see it? Yeah, here, here, here. <laughs> so, see you soon. Bye. Hug.